I've been seeing these in my little machine shop over here. I've got uh, my toolbox with all the ones that wheel. Oh, desk in. That's where my computer is going to live for now. Um, and then the rack that was behind me is over here, and I turned it into two. Um, I've got a couple 3D printers there. More has to come. I'm going to end up doing um, my big printer down there. That's like a 20 inch by 20 inch. Uh, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get another set of these racks. I'm going to make a second tier for it. I'm going to lift that up off the floor a bit. Big printer's going to go down there. Other ones will go up here. Um, then my south bend, I think I'm going to move to this table. That's what I'm thinking about here at least. And uh, I'm going to make that stronger. So I'm going to put you know, wood around the whole thing. Get off those cheap Harbor Freight casters. Um... And that's where that's going to live. And then the Atlas, I think I'm going to take and put like along here, but with like a board uh, that'll go up to the top, you know, along the second tier of shelving. Uh, so I think this little orange desk is going. Um, the router is going to go here once we, we're upgrading from 100 amp, 200 amp. That's going to go there. Um, and then I have a bunch of aluminum extrusion that I'm going to make a uh, enclosure for. This is going to be my touchscreen monitor. I'm running Centrino on that. No, I'm sorry, Centroid. Um, what else? What else? I think that's pretty much it. Obviously, the pile of cinder blocks holding up the dehumidifier is leaving. I put that on a shelf. It's coming together. And I think what I'm going to do, so I got the water, you know, the water filter and stuff here. I'm going to tuck that back there. I'm just going to, like, spin it and put it back there. Get all these pipe insulated. Um... And then really eventually the goal is going to be to uh small this furnace up you know i'm working with a small area eventually we hope to make it bigger but right now we're doing what we can so um i'm gonna try to make that a little more compact and then i'm gonna put like a uh, workbench along this wall where i can put the welder under stuff like that uh that drill press is going and i'm just got an atlas drill press given to me right here it's actually in pretty good shape. Um, it just needs a column and a base. Um, so that's going to end up going over here. I'm going to get rid of the Craftsman. And I think what I'm going to do, I got my compressor and my vacuum, which I'm going to run vacuum air around the shop to like all my different stations. Um, but I think I'm going to create like a like a little shed outside for these. Because one, I don't want to deal with the noise. And two, with the, you know, they're kind of cumbersome in size, especially for something this small. Um, the only thing I, the only other thing I really can bat is my low head area here. So I gotta have to, uh, I don't know, paint it yellow and black or something. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do. But yeah, if you guys see anything, any suggestions, uh, yeah, give me an idea. Thanks.